Scared yesterday. This night. Scared. In my sleep. Scared to die. Uh, well, uh, you know, because uh, when I closed my eyes, I got so scared. I couldn't sleep therefore, so I didn't close my eyes anymore. Well, I hopefully not this night, but then again, I have another this. I'm in the hospital, these girls think I am uh, the husband already, but that's not true. I found someone, Elise is my girlfriend. Uh, uh, it's a long story, but I know her well. I feel so sorry. Well, I, uh, I cannot, uh, cannot talk about this. I will not talk about it, but I go. Don't care, go to heaven. Then I'm young again. See how old I look. I look old. Too old to be true. But then again, I I made uh, a lot of hobbies during this life. A life that I do not want. A life that I do not want. But being, uh, having your eyes closed to sleep and then get scared, uh, that's weird. That's real frightening. I must explain that to the doctor. Tell her. Because of these four walls around me, in the middle of the night, I even can't open the door and walk over the hallway, which is far more uh, helpful to get rid of these fears that are tormenting me. Just walk over the hallway, a short hallway, but that will be also short, too short to satisfy my fears get away my fears, I need to walk outside, I need to feel free, that's it, I need to feel free. If you feel free, then there's nothing, you don't even notice this, because you've never been locked. Everybody that feels free is normal, they do not know how it is to be locked for 22 years. For 22 years, every year it gets worse and worse, unrest. Fears, fears are the worst. Oh, yes. I must tell that to the doctor.